top of the morning to you guys. Why are you obsessed with Irish? Because that's the thing, top of the morning to you. Well, but we're uh, in Turkey. I don't care. Not an island. So, okay, I'll speak Turkish then. Exactly. Gobble, gobble. Last two days left. And we were thinking, uh, let's explore like crazy because to make uh, the mother-in-law and Tusi are gone. So, um, we're going to Ortakoy today. It's meant to be dope. Nice as hell. <laughs> Dina wants to go to uh, shop for some... Um, Sevahir Mall. Yeah, Turkish brands. So we're going to go to Sevahir Mall. You said that good. And then straight after that. I could do the accent, man, if yeah, I want to. Yeah, because look at all the traffic we're just gonna try and walk to Autokoi right because it should only be about 25 30 minutes so we should be all right maybe get a drink on the way we're gonna have a cup here today Jack Turkish jack potato they look amazing yeah they do they like stuff them with loads of weird stuff not weird well it is kind of weird they put like sausage and different things in there nom 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 sounds like a munch guys look I think all over like Istanbul they have things like that for like stray, stray dogs and cats to just go and have a munch, which is amazing. Amazing, that's what we love about it because me and Sid love animals. The Turkish people are very good people, yeah. Like all the stray cats and dogs are like healthy and well fed, and everyone's really nice to them. Not like in other countries, like for example, Egypt, where they can be there's a lot of cruelty to strays, basically. Yeah, and like, and not cats, even strays, even the ones at home. Cats Once like, they're done with them, they just chuck them on the streets. And like cats and dogs openly like sleep in front of people. Now, in, in, even in Britain, they wouldn't do that, they'd be scared. Look at this beautiful mosque. You can't see because of the tree, but wait there. Here it comes. Here we come. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's fantastic. That is fan freaking. Can anyone go in there? Can we go in there? Fantastic. Is it open to people? I don't even know. It must be. It's, it's a mosque, isn't it? Wow, that is so beautiful. Look at all the pigeons. Look at the masks. Look at the pigeons. Look at the masks. Biggest shag potatoes on this planet. Basically a jack potato with shit. With loads everything in it. on it. <laughs> Look with at the everything. size of that. <laughs> Even through the kitchen sink in there. <laughs> Come on, let's go and eat. But we've only got spoons, we don't have forks. How are you supposed to eat that without yeah, fork? God Sid's tucking in already. Where do I begin? <laughs> Come here. That's some good eating. How are you not making a mess? Some good eating. I can't even explain what's in there, there's so much. One fact you guys didn't know about Dina is possibly the messiest eater in the world. I don't know how he's eating what it. What the heck is that? I don't know how to... Look at mine. Just, most of it's in the box. <laughs> most of yours is outside the box. Are okay, you enjoying it? Yeah, yeah. I don't think I'd have it again though. We're in the back of a cab, guys. This is our first, second cab to catch here in December. On the way to the Seva Hill Danbow FL. Yeah. What's Guys, we just got to Seva <laughs> <laughs> I got a red Gina. We just got to Seva Hill Mall. Seva Hill Mall. It it's quite big. It's humongous. It's really quite quite massive. It's the, it's the biggest mall in Europe. I thought this was supposed to be like a little mall full of Turkish brands. There's a bloody Debenhams. I don't want Debenhams. <laughs> all of the suggestions that all of you, all of you Turkish viewers have been telling me to, to go to. So here I am. And here I am. I'm gonna buy some Turkish shoes. To be 
honest with you it was a fail it was a bit of a fail it's, it's a really good mall but i'm not looking for um you know like european brands or just like regular i'm looking for turkish brands so like turkish clothes so I should have picked the Fatih Street thing instead of Seva here more. Well, we don't know where it is. But we don't know how to get there, so basically I'm just gonna have to shop in Grand Bazaar and Sultan Ahmed area. And we're just gonna go to Maddo's now so that we would have done something here and it did. And I might go to McDonald's and get to Sunday too, and then we might just have a Cars Junior and a Popeyes today. That's in Texine Popeyes though. It's tickle up. Anyway, whatever. Yeah, okay, bye! Ended up in the food court, having a Macadies, instead of having an Arby's. This is my perfect meal, because it's literally slices of beef and mustard. Bought my bag, then I bought some more jewellery, and we bought Mama's bag, and now we're trekking all the way up this hill. It's quite steep, yeah, it doesn't look like it, but it bloody well is. Oh, excuse me, you dropped. Sorry. Basically, to go up to the Galant Tower. See the view? Basically. And now uh, this guy wants to. No, I'm. Um, um, oh, no, no, it's okay. No. We're back at the Galant Tower. We're on the lift. We thought we had to go upstairs, but thank God we don't. Going up in the lift. To go out to the tower. To go out to the tower. My lashes are going to be running out, my real ones. My lashes are going to go. Which ones? They're just going to go. When these come off, I'm going to be bald eyed. Really bald eyed. Who was that? You just went. We're going to have a drink upstairs. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We do have to climb the stairs. It's the lift and the stairs. Do it at the top. What is that? Here's a view. Here's a view, guys. <laughs> Oh, it's okay, we're, we're vlogging, filming. Okay. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> uh, we just came from the top of the Galata Tower and it has an epic view, as you can probably see from the pictures that we're going to post on Instagram and stuff. And um, uh, we got some footage, but it doesn't do it justice. <laughs> anyway, we're going to go. We're going home, back home now. Home hotel now. Well, well, hotel home. And I think, yeah, because we were going to go to the Hagia Sophia mosque, but you know, my heels are killing. So uh, I think I would just call it a day. And so we'll call it a day, night. and tomorrow's our last day. We just came back after a long day, and somebody's left this at the hotel. Ipekevi. What is this? What's a fringe cashmere silk? Oh, I think it's a scarf from somebody. Dear in Tokyo, thanks for adding more shine on our beautiful Istanbul with lots of love. Ipekeri. Ooh, thanks Ipekeri. <laughs> Guys, how beautiful are these scarves? Instagram, Ipekeri Kap. Oh, I can't even pronounce that. <laughs>